We are Sean, Emma, Rex and Maggie and our motorhome Renny and together we are The Search 365. Welcome to episode 6 of our Northern England tour. So today um, we're doing a circular walk around uh, water and um, we've started off at Keswick um, at the campsite and we plan on walking all the way around. It's about 9 miles I think. Um, we've just started so um, it's quite cool but not too bad. Uh, the weather, not expecting any rain, so we'll just make our way slowly round. It should be pretty flat all the way round, so uh, yeah, we'll see uh, what we can find. Um, we'll probably just make out cat bells in the distance there. We're about a mile in, um, with about eight to go. hotel which was lovely and watch the birds on the bird feeder for a bit so all sorts amazing and uh, yeah just uh, taking in the views I think Sean's gone to put the drone up Rex doesn't like it so he barks so I have to drag him away and uh, yeah you can see what an amazing spot this is right at the bottom of the lake On the west side of Durban Water, we pass through the beautiful Lingholm Estate, stopping for a well-deserved coffee and cake. We also said hello to the alpacas, which are part of the Alpaca Lee Ever After social enterprise where you can walk and feed the alpacas in several locations in the Lake District. Some very odd cloud formations going on. How awesome is that? Final approach back into Keswick 
Um, guidebook said eight and three quarter miles. Uh, current distant walked 9.83 miles. And we've probably still got about another half a mile to go. So it's definitely a 10 miler, but lovely and mostly flat. So it's pretty easy. It's a nice walk. Lots of places to stop for a cup of coffee or a beer. Um, lots of lovely uh, places to have a picnic. Yeah, brilliant, brilliant walk. What you got? Nothing. What you got? That's fudge. It's like drugs. Mm -hmm. Cut it up, baby. <laughs> no! Where's mine? Can I have some? The smallest bit. Are you going to give me the smallest, tiniest you bit? Choose. No, can I have the biggest bit? You can have whichever bit you mm. like. As long as you only have one bit. <laughs> so as you can see from our pitch we have a mountain view and also down here we have the river Greta I think it's called this is our pitch nice and flat on our standing and going to take you on a bit of a tour. This is our toilet block. Motorhome service point. Now this um, is one of the fields so we're in the top field. So you can see it's all very flat, very pretty. And we head down to the entrance or reception. He's absolutely chucking it down today. So, and this is the second field, which is a bigger field. And we've got another toilet block up there. Rubbish. There's the entrance that you come through. Just going to get a rain blob off. reception so we're right at the top end of Derwent Water and we have views of Cat Bells Skidor and Bl Blencathra and we, from the site you have direct access to the water so I think you have to pay a launching fee for any craft it's about five a day I think And you can see that on a beautiful day, sunny day, we would have an amazing view of the lake. This is the tent field for, for buggers in the rain. There, so we have correct access to Derwent Water. Obviously nobody's out this morning. There's cat bells off to the right. And the campsite, main campsite is there. I'm not going to show you inside the toilets because it's first thing in the morning and obviously the toilets are very busy at this time of day but basically you get four sinks, four toilets, four showers all very clean and tidy
We have the full motorhome service point. So you can fill up with water, get rid of your waste. And I think the toilet emptying is... There you go, it's down there somewhere. Next time in episode 7 of our Northern England tour, we head to Barnard Castle to check out Hamsilly Forest, the castle and our eyesight. <laughs>